YouTube, back with another video, you dig it on what I'm saying? Today, we got mother shapes her son hair as a punishment. You dig it on what I'm saying? Now, I don't understand punishments like this, bro. Because why you got to touch my head? Like, you feel me? Like, I know hair grow back and stuff like that. But I don't think I'm going to cut my son hair. You know what I'm saying? Because he might be grits after he cut his hair. <laughs> he might be looking like his mama. You dig it on what I'm saying? So... I don't know. I don't think I'll go this route, but I'm gonna need y'all to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you new stuff like that. Like the video, bro. You know, so anybody dive straight into it. The video only like five minutes long, bro. So thank God for that. Thank God for this one. You know what I'm saying? I've been gone for a little minute. I've been gone for like a week. Or uh, posting like regular vids. I've been sick, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I've been sick. You know what I'm saying? I got this pimple that's been blowing me. You know what I'm saying? I don't really like pimples. If y'all got stuff for y'all face, let me know. Uh, but yeah, though, let's dive into this, bit. Introduce yourself. Uh, speak clearly. No, oh, she already sound angry. And why are you here? What did you get in trouble for? Is that who? A who? Speak when they can hear you clearly. Is it wrong? What are you saying? Did you clearly? He smoked a vape. And you gonna cut your son's head off because he smoked the vape? Now, I, I I I do understand this. I bet he ain't gonna smoke that vape again. You know what I'm saying? But, I ain't gonna lie. L vape. You know what I'm saying? Throw them bitches away. I'm about to say he deserve it. A vape? I could see some Zaza. But a vape? I can't do vapes, bro. I don't know. I don't know why people just be smoking them vapes. Them vapes just, ugh. Is it wrong? Did you not know that it was wrong? Okay, how many times have we disciplined you on other behavior issues in school about things? They did this before? Uh -huh. A lot. So what do you think your punishment should be, Marcus? So what do you think your punishment should be, Marcus? Just give me a whooping. Come on, Marcus. Hello? So what is it? What, what is your punishment? What should your punishment be, son? In his head, he thinking nothing. How old are you, Marcus? And you know what you're doing is what? But you still continue to do it, do you not? You're 17, in the ninth grade. You're constantly in behavior issues. We left the 17 in what grade? 17, but you still continue to do it, do you not? You're 17, in the ninth grade. Seventeen in the ninth grade. Yeah, cut it all off. <laughs> cut it off. Seventeen in the ninth grade. But uh, hell no, nah, boy. Y'all had supposed to be a junior or a senior or something. Freshman. Bro, this Negro right here is the definition of a super senior. Literally. 17 in the ninth grade. Cuz ain't gonna be about. Oh, look, I failed that math. Cuz ain't gonna be about 21, 22 by the time he graduate. Cuz you supposed to be damn near graduating college at that point. <laughs> you feel me? Oh, hell no. Nah. Cut it off, please. You're constantly in behavior issues. We left the school this morning talking to the principal, the counselor. And another teacher in reference to helping my son with his behavior issues and his grades. But he continues to steal. Mama look thick. And fail grades and classes in school. So I asked him as we all can see what his punishment should be. He's very disrespectful. Everything. He can do the work, but he fails to do the work. He just doesn't care. He has a lack of motivation, everyone. So with his lack of motivation, I'm going to give him a appreciation for having hair. Since he cherishes this, this is what his mother is going to do for his discipline. Ooh, of course. This is for him to understand I'm not going to continue to tolerate disrespect to anyone. So if he continues this, the next step I'm going to do is I'm going to whip him and I'm going to post this as well. Oh my god. See, that's where I got the problem. I was like, bro, there's something I don't like here. 
It's to post it on the social media, bro. Like, dang, cutting the hair off wasn't enough. <laughs> now you gotta post. You gotta post that bit all over Facebook. Now all the aunties and uncles clowning my ass. On Instagram, whatever it is posted on. Like, dang, you you already about to cut this nigga hair. It say shaves. Oh my god. If any of you on Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat don't appreciate my discipline rules, then guess what? Call CPS. But first of all, call me. Y'all do that. Y'all do give that. Give me my phone number. And if you don't like how I do it, yeah. actually, let me get that number. I might need that number. <laughs> it's eight zero four nine two five zero oh. one two six. Hold on, hold on. All parents that do not like how four Derry Glen Road, Indian Trail, North Carolina. My phone number is 804-925-0126. All parents that do not like how I train or bring up my child, Zero one on, bring it. Two six. Add contact thick mother zebra dress. Yeah, we got locked that in. Do you know what your discipline is? Do you appreciate? That's all you appreciate is this hair, right? Oh! She hollering ass. You embarrass me, I'm gonna embarrass you. This is over. Oh my god. I'm going to the police if I'm the son. I ain't gonna lie. Child endangerment. Oh my god. Please tell me there's a guard on that, bitch. Ah, oh, hell no. Nice. That bitch bald. Nice. This is how he's going to go to school, too. Gave him the he George him. Jefferson. Beautiful hair. Beautiful hair, son. You don't appreciate what we do for you? Then I'm going to show you. You're going to show me some appreciation. I'm not going to whoop you. This ain't even humiliation. I would have took the so whipping. You humiliate me in school, have the teachers call me, the principal, and everybody call me. So guess what? What goes around comes around. Nah, I would have took the whooping, bruh. Beautiful hair. What is hair? What does hair equivalent? How does hair equivalent to vaping? Oh, no. I feel like there's some internal jealousy or something. Mom, let me see your hair. I've talked to you. Is it the same length? Is that where we're getting at? Is that where the frustration coming from? Because of vape? Am I, if I catch my son smoking a vape, I'm going to smack him and tell him don't do it again and break that bit in his face. Oh, man. I've encouraged you. I've seen counseling for you, and this is still the treatment that I, as a parent, receive. So if you don't know how to appreciate what we as parents do for you, this is my appreciation to you. Do you have anything to say on your behalf? I'm running away. Excuse me? I'm Look running everybody. away. So am I right or am I wrong? You're wrong. Hello? I'm right? Because it could be worse, right? What could be worse, Marcus? What? What? You could be what? What's worse than this? How can it be worse, Marcus? Hello? You tell me. You can be six feet in the grave or in a jail cell. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> he's not going to be six feet underground or in a jail cell because he's smoking a vape. Now, if he's smoking that bit like it, <laughs> like it's second nature, then eventually you might be in the ground, you know what I'm saying, due to lungs and, you know what I'm saying? But he not about to be. <laughs> Bro, oh hell no. Nah. I'm about to crash out. No, I'm not. So therefore, to keep my son out of jail and six feet under, this is the way I intend on continuing to discipline my child. And again, if any of you don't like it, this is the way my son I got the is number. going back to school on Wednesday since he is now suspended. Absolutely he not. Knows better. I Absolutely better. not. He knows better. So when you know better, you do better. Thank you for viewing and have a wonderful day. Absolutely not, bruh. Absolutely not. You, you want me to come to school. So you gonna shave my head in the middle 
in the middle and she shaved in the back too so really he just got a rainbow effect going on on the top of his head then you go and post it on social media and she named every single social media she named snapchat facebook instagram tiktok she probably said listen and now you want me to go to school looking like this oh no sir no no sir because i'm gonna get in trouble at school because i'm gonna wear a beanie or a hoodie no i'm wearing a no i'm wearing a do-rag I'm going to wear, on top of the durag, I'm going to wear a beanie. And on top of the beanie, I'm going to wear a hoodie. And if the teacher say something to me, tell my son, take off your hoodie. Take off your beanie. Take off your durag. I'm crashing out. Are you dumb? Absolutely not. Crazy as hell. Like, comment, subscribe.